all right guys it's Collins again from now student hub and in this video I'll be showing you how to upload your passport how to upload your passport now if you watch here now this top here you see that there's an arrow here that's saying that soon needs to upload a recent photo this is because without uploading the very fo the, the photograph or your passport you'll be able to do your exam registration you need to upload this very passport your passport for you to be able to do your exam registration also since it's actually saying you need to upload a, a, a passport you won't be able to print out your id card as well because there won't be any photo attached to the id card so you need to upload your what's it called your id card it's very important you need to upload your id card it's very important so first of all you need to go to here click on tax upload your photo you click on choose the media picker you go to here you now locate where that very photo uh, that very passport is in your uh, what's it called in your file manager or your phone rather or your system as the case may be so here now you just select uh, it's a recent and here this is the image here now watch this image name is actually this so there's a high tendency this will not it's not going to work it's not going to work. so let's just submit it and try it and see good so according to what it's saying here, it say fine name this does not match your matric number so what does this mean this means that you need to change the fine name to your matric number so you need to change the fine name to your matric number so you go need to go to your file manager and change your matric uh, what's it called and change the file name back uh, to your matric number or to your matric number rather so i'm going to do that real quick all right i've now renamed the file to my matric number so i'll have to take that step again i'll have to go back again and go to this place tax upload your picture or your photo rather then choose file media picker then go to re recent look at it now it's now renamed to the matric number so now it's now the matric number and i click on submit it will now submit so the picture is uploaded now when i refresh my browser now it's going to appear so let me refresh my browser it has appeared so it has appeared now so now you can be able to you can now uh, do a, your exam restriction without any restriction so thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe and also like these videos thank you